Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today, we're going to learn about two-step equations, and we're going to solve each equation. So, if I was given this equation here, negative 10 equals 10 times k minus 9. Okay. Well, my first step here is I see there's that multiplication outside the parentheses. So, I'm actually going to divide by 10 first. That's opposite of that multiplication is division. This allows me to cancel these tens out, leaving a one there. And one times anything is anything, right? So I'm just going to leave that out, and I'm left with a k minus nine, and I don't need the parentheses anymore. Well, negative ten divided by positive ten is just a negative one, okay? Negative divided by positive is a negative, and ten divided by ten is one. So negative ten divided by ten is a negative one. So now I have negative one equals k minus nine. I then have to add a nine to both sides, okay? This is the opposite of that subtraction, leaving me a k on the right, but on the left, negative 1 plus 9 is actually just 8, positive 8, okay? Negative 1 plus 9 is 8. It's similar to 9 minus 1, which is 8. You can think of it like that if you need to. Well, 8 equals k. So we rearrange this to make it look nicer. k equals a positive 8, and there we go. We have our final answer. So let's recap here. Negative 10 equals 10 times k minus 9. If I divide by 10 to both sides, that's my first step. So 10, uh, the multiplication, 10, uh, divided both sides. <laughs> All right, 10 times the parentheses divided by 10. They cancel, leaving me k minus 9 on the right. Negative 10 divided by 10 is negative 1. I then have a minus 9 here, so I add a 9, which is opposite, right? Leaving me a k left here. And negative 1 plus 9 is a positive 8. And then at the end, I just rearranged it uh, to look nicer. And so my final answer is k equals 11. Look, 8. K equals 8, not 11. K equals 8. K equals 8. Sorry, I don't know why I said 11. <laughs> K equals 8.